Good evening, Patrick. Is this your first castle experience? No, my second. Um, are you pleased you attended this seminar again? Then? Definitely, definitely. I've just uh, finished uh, a different um, like meeting of the minds of entrepreneurs, uh, which lasted for a year, um, and uh, just coming to the birthday event uh, two months ago, actually, I, I got more inspiration than in all of the year of that other thing I did. So that's why I decided to return. Was there a point during this week when something suddenly struck you differently and you decided to go and change what you do because of that? Yes. Um, as you know, I, I have been here before um, and I had my plans when I left and I, uh, I got off course more or less. I got carried away with other stuff. I'm not, um, I did found another business so I didn't uh, completely fail. But uh, coming back here really showed me that uh, I should have stuck with that. Um, and that's what I'm going to do in the near future. How has your vision changed of what you can achieve? My vision was too small, to be honest. Uh, like, uh, I kept thinking back to like the preparation, uh, all the questions we had to answer. And uh, the longer I was here, I really was like, you know, actually, this, this might just be too small, actually. I should maybe just aim higher, you know? So even if I miss, where I miss is going to be much higher up. Dan talks a lot about taking action now. Do you have plans of what you would like to achieve within the next 21 hours, 21 days? Well, I'm certainly going to um, finish my vision. That's number one. Uh, I know which direction um, I have to fill in the specifics. Um, and then just uh, go after that as soon as possible. Um, I have, uh, I'm lucky to have very good management in my companies and therefore I have uh, potential to get started right away. Are you pleased with what the final outcome of this seminar has been? Yes, totally. Especially the, um, like the live sessions with other people that are doing it. And then when you hear like someone else, uh, like the guy we saw today, um, and um, he goes like, uh, yeah, I have a company that does that much and uh, I spend that much time per week managing that company. And I go like, hey, wait a minute, that's exactly my numbers, you know, um, to the dollar actually, as I mentioned. And that really, um, like, when you hear it from the horse's mouth, it's one thing, but then when you see someone else already taking action on what you just heard, that just makes it more, even more real. After another week with Dan, how has your life changed? Well, I realized that I um, am certainly, even after having come here uh, two and a half years ago, um, I certainly still kept on uh, micromanaging um, and there's no excuse for it, I have to say. So I'm, I'm, I'm really going to focus on becoming more of a macro thinker, more of a macro manager. What would you recommend to those watching this on YouTube? Uh, well, those that um, are just watching for personal entertainment, um, I don't have anything to say to you. Uh, for those that want to get started, you know, just fucking do it. Ideally come here because it's, there's a reason why I come back for a second time and I will be back for a third time as well, that's for sure. So, just fucking do it.